Jung Dan Yang made his billions running EVN, which is well regarded in the international corporation. Vingroup CEO, Forbes billionaire, Mr. Pham Nhak Vuong's investment portfolio is nothing but outstanding. The missionary Togawa, Daikin CEO, launched Daikin Greenhouse Project for sustainable production. The Sharks united here today to pass their experience and capital for the next future of entrepreneur. We welcome you to Shark Tank. Next up, these three aspiring entrepreneurs believe that they can make changes incrementally through innovations regarding electricity, air conditioning and transportation systems that can be implemented locally. The Sharks are hungry as ever, but these entrepreneurs are ready. Hello Sharks, my name is Juan, this is me, and this is Juan, and we are from VAS. So, for the past few decades, climate change has always been our big concern, and I believe that we all agree it is everyone's responsibility to save our planet. Within our school, we came up with three different aspects that we think that could be potentially be changed. And those three are um, school buses, air conditioners, and um, electricity. And we're here looking for $500,000 for 10% of our company. Firstly, I want to talk about my ideas is the direct air capture system. So, air conditioner. We have it everywhere nowadays, in the school, at homes, everywhere. We need air conditioner. It's, a, it's an essential for our daily life. Not, not only for our con convenience, but it can, can also help people with uh, breathing difficulties. In our school, we have air conditioners everywhere, but these are the air conditioners in our school five years ago. Very helpful for the environment. And this, this picture shows that there are many cameras of the, uh, the old AC in our uh, school. But now we've changed into a more environmental friendly uh, AC, more energy saving and less helpful for the environment. But personally, I think we can, there's still more room for improvement. That's why I present to you. The direct air capture system, CO2, the CO2 from the environment will be captured by, by the fans, very powerful fans there, and will be transformed into uh, carbon at this, this stop. CO2, it, it can be produced as fire, fire extinguisher and plastic to use for our daily life. As you can see, these wires are very dangerous and very messy for a student in the campus. We would like it to be changed into something that's more protective and safer for the student. And we would also want to uh, use uh, more, a different source of electrical energy, a uh, more renewable one, uh, such as the sun. Basically, the sun is the bar of energy. It gives light to plants, uh, animals, and everything on Earth. We can harness the power of the sun in the form of electricity using solar panels and solar cells. They can also be stored in battery for later use. As you can see, our school has plenty of space on the roof, but there, is, there are no solar panels. So it would be a great feature to install them on our school. It would help to reduce the, the energy cost as well. Okay, so that's it for the electrical and the conditioners. Now we're going for the school buses. These school buses are, are quite old already and they use uh, quite a lot of the fuel. And then now we have changed into the more advanced cars which use less fuel. But then I think we could still improve it and use even less uh, fuel. So we came up with an idea using the bit the fast electrical buses. And we'll make it into uh, our school buses for in the past year, uh, we started a Green Day Run project, which there are over 2,000 uh, competitors joining. We run over 5 kilometers in order to fundraise for our tree plants in Atkamsa. Here, we plant over 3,000 trees in uh, Atkamsa. Here at the school, we also have a 3R project, which stands for Reduce, Reuse, and Recycle. 
its main goal is to raise awareness for the student to uh, protect the environment. We also planted poster and sign to turn off electrical appliances to reduce energy costs. This uh, can reduce the CO2 emission when uh, when producing electricity at the factory. Okay, so those are the three aspects that we need to change. So what are you shot? What do you think about these three? So I myself think this is a uh, very realistic program that you guys are working on. Because it is very true that our world and our environment is slowly deteriorating. Very aspiring plans. I'm deeply interested in you, uh, you guys' projects. Now, uh, the most uh, thing, the most interesting thing that I would be interested in investing is the air conditioning system. The system is simply removing carbon dioxide out of the, the air. If we can implement that into our own air conditioners, then the world would be uh, rid, rid, rid of CO2 in no time. Our companies have uh, developed the inverter technology which allows uh, our air conditioner to be as efficient as possible, which means they save more than 50% of their energy. So if we can implement both the systems and our together, then the air conditioner will reach a new stage, a new technology will arise. That will benefit humankind as a whole and will improve the air quality of our future generations. Wow, this is such a spectacular plan. Why won't us three shops work together on this ambitious and innovative project from these representatives from VAS? Because they have major in air conditioner, electricity car, and solar car, which three of us are um, strongly good at. So we will need a few moments to discuss. It's a trouble in one million. Each of us three million and then 10% share of the kid for the business. I think this is a very nice initiative for the So, three and one. So, one in each, 10% each. Let's do that. After much discussion with the two shops here, we have come to a final conclusion that we will offer you guys a final price. One million each divided uh, on a screen, on a screen, and then each of us will get 10% and we'll make the uh, 30% share between the three companies. Then, will you guys accept our final offer? Okay, guys, we have the deal. We have the deal.